This week on Canada in the Rough, we're in central BC on a migratory waterfowl hunt. We're back in Vanderhoof, BC for a very special waterfowl episode. Vanderhoof is home to some great people and great local businesses. And this week, Canada in the Rough's Paul Beasley will once again be outfitted by Chad Westbrook of Wing and Trout Outfitters. Joining Paul and Chad on this hunt will be Chad's wife, Ginger, and their eldest daughter, Taylor. This is Taylor's very first hunt, and we were lucky enough to share in this very special experience with her. Hunting as a family unit is not only important to the future of hunting, but it has to be one of the most enjoyable and memorable things a family can do together. Stay tuned as Paul is hunting ducks and geese in central BC with the Westbrook family, this week on Canada in the Rough. Take him, take him, take him. about do it, Chad? I think so, I think we're ready. Excellent. Well, I am extremely excited. Two years ago, we had the pleasure of hunting with Drake and Hunter. I mean, it was, was that Hunter's, what, first, second, third time hunting? Ever, yeah. Yeah, and I mean, cool. he shot some absolutely awesome birds. We got some epic footage of him finishing off our morning. And this year, we get the pleasure of having Ginger and Taylor with us. How did this all come about? <laughs> well, Chad asked us if we wanted to come out and do this with him today. And he's been pumped about it all year. Pumped it's been most up. exciting. Yeah. I've been waiting for this hunt all day. I bet, I bet. All year, actually, most exciting well, hunt. It's not very often you get to hunt with no. your wife and your daughter. I mean, the boys are at home babysitting. I know. And the girls get to go out and play. It's yeah. a good yeah. day. That's awesome. <laughs> well, I love it because I love it for a multitude of reasons. I have three girls of my own. My wife is at home with them right now. I don't know if they're going to hunt. They're still young. But I certainly look forward and dream of the day that I might be able to share the, the woods and the fields with them like this. So you're a lucky man, Chad. Yeah, as my dad's always told me that if you take your kids hunting, you won't have to hunt for your kids. So. I totally agree with yeah. that. Good. I know exactly where she is today. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's good. Well, I'm excited. we got about a half hour before light. We're yeah, pretty much set up. We're ready to go. Just need to park the truck. Should be good mixed bag today. I'm excited. Can't wait to see him shoot. Excellent. Well, we'll test him out in a few minutes. <laughs> Wing and Trout Outfitters is located in Vanderhoof, British Columbia. This is it. We are in our fifth season this year. We offer a world-class operation, goose hunt and duck hunt. Typically, we're hunting anywhere from barley fields to wheat fields to oat fields. Early on in the season, we hunt in alfalfa fields. We have one of the best resources in the world as far as the Pacific Flyway goes. The sheer numbers of waterfowl migrating through this Pacific Flyway are just astounding. A lot of people talk about the good old days and uh, we're experienced the now days. The days are right now. This is some of the best times to be hunting and harvesting waterfowl. Well, ducks out in front. Ducks come in, let's shoot them. It's so cool. Okay, let's shoot them. Nice shot, Taylor. Good job, Good Taylor. job. <laughs> Mojo's got him. Woo! <laughs> How'd that feel? How was that? that was awesome, first bird. <laughs> <laughs> Great job. Good, good job, good job. Good boy. That was so good. Nice job, Taylor. Thanks. Ginger, nice job. Thanks. Does Mojo retrieve blind? Yeah, there's another duck. Here comes another duck, duck right in. in the hole. Okay, shoot it, shoot it, shoot it, shoot it. Take it, take it. Good job, Ginger. Well done. <laughs> nice Look shot. at that. Oh, Come. that was hold, awesome. Hold. <laughs> we got more birds in the sky, more birds in the sky. <laughs> Here we go. See the pair? Yep. Take him, take him. 
Good job. Good job. Two for two. That's awesome. a lot of birds in the air. Good nice job, job, Taylor. Good shot. This is awesome. Birds everywhere in the sky. See this big flock right here? Yeah. Pick out one bird and they come in. Take them, take them. Nice shoot. That was really good. We got a bunch, girls, boys and girls. Awesome. <laughs> More birds. Jet, bunch of come, come. There's some high on the left. Here they come, here they come. Take them, take them, take them. Good shooting, yeah, well done. Nice awesome. job, well done. <laughs> Girls, I'm nice impressed. Shot. Holy! Ooh, you see mine fall out there? Yeah. <laughs> Tell me, Taylor, is this worth missing school for? Yes. <laughs> Don't know what my teacher will think about that, though. <laughs> awesome. Nice shooting. Ladies? Lifted all those other birds, too. That's good. Well, my kids love to go hunting. They love to be with their dad. Um, my oldest son really got involved and would be the first one up in the morning to go hunting. And they've all learned to love it being in our family, so it's a great thing for us all to be together. And our family, we, we all like to play sports in the community and different things. But when we go hunting as a family, we get to spend just one-on-one -on -one quality time with each other. We get to have lots of laughs, lots of memories that we get to share with each other. And I wouldn't trade it for anything. Here come the duck, right in the hole. Shoot the ducks. <laughs> They're lining right up. Here they come on the right. Lining the up right. nice. Shoot them, shoot them. Shoot. Woo, good shot. Nice Kate. job. Good job, guys. <laughs> you having fun? Yeah. Right on. <laughs> Mojo's doing a great job, too. 12 o'clock. There we go. They're dropping in hard. Yep. Shoot them. Take them. Good job. Well done. <laughs> Good shooting, girls. I am impressed. That's awesome, Taylor. <laughs> It's a low, low group. Low take group. Take them, take them, take them. Nice. Woo! Good job. Woohoo! Ducks, here we go. On your right. Hold. Oh. Yes, yes. Let them come in. That's fine, you birds. Let them come right on top. <laughs> Oh wow. Here come the ducks. Here that we go. Is awesome. Oh, look at that. They're cupping, they're cupping. Pick a bird. So many. Off to your right, off to your right. Let them come, let them come. Get ready. Let them come, let them come. Take them, take them, take them. That was awesome. Good job. shooting. Raining Woo! birds. Wow, that was a heck of a view. There's hundreds of birds in that flock. Oh, that was awesome. It's almost hard, eh, when they're they're coming in so many layers. Yeah, yeah. It's almost hard to pick out your bird because it's like three-dimensional. <laughs> North America has four waterfowl migratory flyways. These ancient routes track the migration of waterfowl from their breeding grounds to their wintering areas, an amazing journey that millions of waterfowl take every year. This particular area of central BC that we are hunting this week is right in the middle of the Pacific Flyway, which stretches from the Arctic Circle down the Pacific coast to Central America. 
Though we still don't know how ducks and geese navigate these very far distances, scientists believe the birds take cues from the position of the sun, moon, and stars, along with geographic landmarks and magnetic fields, invisible to the human eye. Here's four of them coming right here. See them? Yeah. Here we go. Take them, take them, take them. Woo, Taylor. Well done. <laughs> There's two. And oh. that finishes the hunt for the day. Nice shooting, guys. Oh, yeah. Well done. <laughs> well done. <laughs> Chad, that was another absolutely incredible shoot. Oh, nice. I mean, we still got a little bit of room on our duck limit, but that's it for the geese, so. Yeah, the geese are done. That was nice. Good job, guys. That's that great. awesome. Good. <laughs> I got, you, you uh, exceeded my expectations, I gotta admit. That was impressive. <laughs> That was good. Fun day. Well, well done. Thanks a lot. That was a great shoot. Here's a single right here. Ginger, hang him. Good shot. Good shot. Good job, Mojo. Oh, oh, there's birds right here on the right, on the right. Take them, take them. Good nice job. job. Good shooting. I think we definitely doubled up on a few there. <laughs> There's a flat straight ahead. Bottom right, bottom right. All right, let's take him. Take him, take him, take him. Take him. Good job. Dude, well is that done. You or me? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. We'll just take we'll Woo. take it. Good shooting. Four for that four. That was awesome. Nice shooting, ladies. Yeah. Turn in. Here we go. They're coming in. Take them. Woo, Taylor. Good, Good job. Shooting. Sometimes you just got to reach up there and touch them. Get the ones on the bottom when they come in. Take them, take them, take them. Good shooting, well done. Nice shooting. Well done. Nice awesome. <laughs> Dude, they were oh, awesome. Awesome. Good job. Good job, Taylor. Back, right that was awesome, you guys. Nice job. This year, Ginger uh, was able to, she's, she's gone hunting with me several times, but this year, it's really a, a special time of year for us because she's able to come out with Taylor, our daughter, and the statistical numbers show that women hunters have increased and multiplied, and the hunting opportunities for not only men, but women are, are there, and I've actually seen uh, a couple smiles on my daughter's face that was uh, pretty special, so. <laughs> It's a, it's a treat for me because my daughter, she's not showed much interest in hunting. As Ginger was able to come out and, and support me and the, the love and passion that I have, Taylor seemed to follow it. And, and uh, when 
a mother gets involved, the rest of the family follows. And I think it's that important to support whatever your children want to do and, and, and be involved in the outdoors. Here we go, here's this pair right here. Coming right in the hole. Get ready. Take him, take him. Good shooting, good shooting. Nice shooting. Well done. Thanks. And that's it for the evening. Well done. Nice job, ladies. Well Paul. done. Yeah, good evening, really hunt, good. gentlemen and ladies. <laughs> Taylor. Oh, I can't believe the grin. I wish I had a camera. <laughs> Your, the grin's as big as the sky. <laughs> we do have a camera. I know. We well, on national television. That's, that's true, but. Well grand. done. That was fun, you guys. Thanks for being here, Taylor, Ginger. Thanks. Paul, appreciate you coming. Hey, thanks for having me back. Appreciate it. Oh, you're welcome. Enjoyed it immensely. <laughs> Keith and Kevin will be jealous. Well, let's get these birds packed up and get in. Nice job, ladies. You know, one of the great privileges I have as one of the co-hosts of Canada Rough Television Show is the opportunity to travel across the country and meet incredible people. That's truly what hunting is all about. You know, we had an incredible time out here with the Westbrook family. Chad and Ginger, incredible people with incredible kids. That's one of the great things I love about hunting is the opportunity to be able to go out to socialize, to enjoy the bounties of nature, to enjoy it both in the field and at home in the kitchen. We had an incredible time out here. We shot lots of geese, lots of ducks. You know, as you saw in the footage, there's an abundance of wildlife here. In fact, in this exact area, they went from a five goose a day possession limit to 10 a day. So they actually doubled it because truthfully, hunters weren't shooting enough birds. So they needed to, to give the hunters an, another opportunity to be able to help manage that population. It just goes to show you, hunting, it's scientifically based, it's, it's proven management strategy. It's effective, it's needed, and not only that, it provides great opportunities for families to spend time together. You know, if you ever have the chance to come to British Columbia to hunt waterfowl, you've got to do it. I'm your host, Paul Beasley from Canon the Rough. Remember to enjoy the greatness of Canada and be proud of your hunting heritage. Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe to our page and follow us on Facebook and Instagram.